Hello, my name is Nikolai Patrykov and in this video I'm going to show you how to integrate BMC Remedy with Atlassian Jira using ZigiOps. The first step is to connect to the systems. It is a very simple uh, task to do as we only require the URL, integration user and password. Same is valid for both systems and of course the integration user is not an admin but a very limited user that is used only for this integration. After we connect successfully to the systems and have the OK status, we can proceed to the actual integration. Here we have two approaches. First is to start the integration from scratch or just use a, one of our pre-built templates that are based on real customer cases. So I'll start with a template and just load one that is relevant, a Remedy Incident to Jira Task. With a few clicks I have just loaded and it comes with all the uh, operations and actions that need to be taken in order to uh, successfully achieve the bi-directional integration between the two, two products. Um, what we need here is first to specify the systems that we're integrating, Remedy, Jira, then we have the entities or the records that we're connecting, so everything that we have access to is shown here, in different projects, different issue types, everything is here. After I uh, save it, my integration is actually ready to be activated and in case I need to uh, perform some modifications on the different operations, in this case we have an operation for uh, creating a task, for updating the task based on incident updates, backsync or additional enrichment with information from the task into the incident. So if I uh, decide to change something, uh, I can go for each of the actions and change the trigger condition, the uh, mechanism, how we collect data, it is polling or web services listener, we can specify whatever we want, define the interval as it is configurable from 10 seconds to days and uh, weeks. So once I do that, I will just uh, save it. The next and in fact last part of the integration flow is to go over the field mapping and see if everything is fine here or if we need to fine tune it. In the field mapping we can apply uh, different mapping tables, conditions, or just plain mapping between the fields as it is shown here. After we are done with that, we can just activate the integration and it is going to start functioning from this moment. Now it's time to create a new incident which will activate our bidirectional integration between Remedy and Jira. Right away we can see the direct link that is pointing us to the Jira system and the newly created Jira task. So I just copy the link and open it. This will uh, show us the exact task that we have created through the integration with ZOPS. In this task we have everything according to the mapping, also the source incident ID and a direct link to the remedy incident so we can use it for cross launching and of course everything is bidirectional based on the configuration that we have done. This is how you configure the BMC Remedy and Jira integration through ZOPS. Thanks for watching.